Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Hofstra Athletics Pride Club Golf Outing and Hall of Fame induction ceremony. Thank you all for being here to share this exciting evening with us. There is something special about Hofstra, and this event reminds me of this every year. This evening, we get to honor our legacy and some members of the past generations. What a class. Class by every measure. And when you look at them, when I was asked what I, they thought made this class special was who they are, not necessarily what they did. Coach Damian Rabluski, when you walked into my life, man, it was, uh, you delivered. You, you made a, uh, you made a pr promise in my mom. I wasn't only gonna play football, but I was gonna get a degree. And he made that happen. You know, all I wanted y'all to know is when I took the field, I played for you and my family. And uh, any opponent that saw Hofstra coming out, coming out, I'd tell them, I hope they realize I was coming to win football games. And 77 was throwing the first punch. People talk about this Mount Rushmore of athletic programs or all-time greats. She's on it. As an athlete in this program and for playing for the legendary Bill Edwards, it was instilled in us always to be students of the game, which I now incorporate that mentality every day as a teacher as a coach and in the game of life. What is so impactful as we see here through everybody tonight, as I reflect on my softball career, it really is the family atmosphere that this university embraces. I am filled with gratitude when I look back at my four years at Hofstra. I was so happy to play college field hockey and my experience at Hofstra gave me so much in return. Thank you to all my coaches, trainers, strength coaches, the Hofstra Athletics Department for making me feel like I was special, like I was a professional athlete. What moving to Long Island did for me was gave me opportunity. Along with opportunity, what everybody needs is support. That's where family comes in. Whether it's our nuclear families, our extended family, and our Hofstra family. And the Hofstra family, like our real family, has lasted forever for all of us because of our experiences that we had when we were there. Tents last 18 hours. I'll just share, 18 hours. We get the flight, we're gonna be here at two, no problem. And we're in the air and, and the chief comes on and he says, hey, listen, oh, we got a problem. There's storms and we can't get there. We gotta land in Philly. So we end up with a taxi driver. His name was Mercy and he's the man. And we give him a $100 tip. Mercy's the man. And I was hoping that, I was hoping that some way, some day, uh, we would get to say thank you publicly. Because uh, it means a lot uh, to get to thank all those that lifted us along this journey. It means a lot to us. But we have an extended family here. The, the Hofstra family is real to us. Life was good and there's nothing we wouldn't have done to get here. I am so grateful for the opportunity to be named one of the head coaches here. This event is one of my favorites because you literally gather in a room with multi-generational people that bleed the blue and gold. It's pretty cool.